it the show where I find crafts on Pinterest and then make them and then maybe you make them too or maybe not. Let's get real. Today we are making friendship bracelets because what shows that you have any friends more than things on your arms? We are going to be making a bracelet today out of hex nuts and string and that's it. String, hex nuts, scissors. Real friends are there for you. You know, if you're like throwing up, they like come and they eat it. A real friend, like when you go outside, they go potty right away. So you don't have to walk forever and ever and ever. They don't just fart on you and then not apologize because they can't speak English. Like someone else we know here. The farting dog, Jones. Cause he farted on me earlier. And I thought we were friends. Not so much. First thing you're gonna do is measure out three pieces of string because we're gonna be doing a basic braid. I say about this much. What's that, two feet? I want them all to be the same length. I tried a really thick string and this is what we ended up with. <laughs> it's aggressive, I'll be honest. I probably wouldn't wear it. I started off with really big hex nuts. So make sure that the string you're using and the hex nut you're using make sense together. Now that you have your string, you're going to make a knot to tie it with. Fold it over, and then you're gonna knot this whole bit so that there is a loop at the end. Okay, then you're gonna pull this down and make this, sure this loop is this knot is tight on here, which I'm not doing the best job at. You know, I've had a lot of best friends, none of which have ever farted on me. You know, sometimes people aren't who you thought they were, or dogs, they aren't the dog you thought they were. So you have a loop here, and now we're gonna secure this down so that we can make the rest of the bracelet. But tape this part down, and we're gonna start braiding. If you don't know how to braid, you probably shouldn't be watching this, but you'll learn, I hope. Put the three pieces of string, separate them, and you're gonna cross from side to side. So you're gonna cross this one over the middle, and then you're gonna cross the next one over the middle. Let's see how this goes. You're gonna braid for about two inches. So now you've got a couple inches of braid here. You're gonna wanna add your first hex nut. I'm going with black. Black is a pretty cool color. And we have to be stylish. So slide that up to the outside. Cross that over the middle. Braid it. Okay, so now you have this cross. You wanna hold it so it doesn't move. Because if it does, then it starts flipping and twisting and then you can't make this damn thing. Holding it tight, pushing the other one up and crossing that then over the middle string. So you're still doing a braid. You're just adding a hex knot every time you make a, a braiding. See how that twisted right there? It just twisted the wrong way. You've gotta hold on to this sucker. So now you've added however many hex nuts you wanna add. But just keep braiding. Once you've put on as many as you'd like to, keep braiding. Okay, so whatever length you want, measure it out, see what you'd wear, measure your friend's wrist, I don't know. And then once you're done, you're gonna make a knot on the end. It's not brain surgery, you guys. <laughs> but you know what is brain surgery? To some people, friendship. They don't get it, they don't know how to do it. Anyway, you're done. But it wouldn't really be a friendship bracelet if you didn't have friends to give it to. Luckily, I've got two friends here. Please welcome Allie and Georgia from Cooking Channel's Tripping Out. Guys. Girl, let me see. Friendship. Friendship. Hi. Friendship. Bye, hug. Major hug. Girl hug. I feel like I'm pressing too much of my body on yours. Can you no, I like boner? it. I do feel your boner and it's pleasant. Okay. I'm sweating. I made you guys these. Oh my gosh, I love these, <gasps> Jocelyn. What's this one so tiny? Oh, this one's for Jones, but Aww. yeah, he Aww. doesn't get it because he farted earlier on me. I feel like you guys should make up with a friendship bracelet. I think you should do that because the thing is, George and I are best friends and to this day, we could probably fart on each other all day and we'd still be best friends at the end of the day. We'd be very smelly. Yeah, yeah, but you'd apologize. I would, yeah. But you have to accept apologies. That's what I learned. Mm. You have to be willing. And sometimes sulking is a form of apology. <laughs> face. That's face. a sorry face. That's a shame. I guess it is. He is right. Thanks so much. I love this. Look at all this. How cute you look. Oh my gosh. Yay. 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 Thank, Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank See you, you next you. time. Boom. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. Do not forget to subscribe. I make a dinosaur planner with Grace Helbig. And me and Hannah Hart making a vase out of a light bulb. Mm -hmm. Come back next week for a new video. See you guys.